Thank you, Madam Deputy Speaker. Can we have a debate um, on the negative impacts Labour-run Bradford Council's oh, clean air zone tax is having on local businesses, Sorry, right. not only in Keighley but also Shipley and indeed yeah, yeah, yeah. within Bradford City itself? but also the negative impacts it's having on local residents in villages like East Morton, which are experiencing much higher levels of traffic congestion and speeding as a result of motorists choosing to take alternative view, uh, routes to avoid Labour's ridiculous yeah. tax on hard-working people. Yeah. Well, I thank my hon. Friend for raising this uh, important point. Um, there, there are, across the country, uh, good and sensible schemes which are, are tackling uh, uh, air pollution. The issue that so many people have with the, the type of scheme that the hon. Gentleman's constituents are, ha are having to endure, uh, but also, most notably, uh, residents and businesses uh, in London, uh, is because uh, it is just a revenue raising exercise. It doesn't take into account someone's ability to make the transition that is being asked of them. And it is not just affecting these areas, it is affecting everyone. In my constituency, I have traders that want to come and provide services to London. There will be constituencies surrounding the Honourable Gentleman who will have traders and businesses that need to get into uh, those communities, and they are now being priced out of doing that. We should be supporting people to keep more of the money that they earn for their businesses to thrive, and we need to innovate, and that is how we're going to make this transition.